this video, we will introduce a few tools for writing and drawing notes in Squid. The tool picker can be found in the top right of the screen. The pen tool is the basic tool for writing and drawing. You can change the thickness of your pen strokes by dragging a slider left and right. Use the color picker to change your pen color. There is a default color set that will cover most of your note-taking color needs with a variety of colors in normal, light, and dark shades. If you're feeling creative though, you can create even more colors with this custom color picker. Your pen tool can also be switched to a highlighter. Highlight important parts of your notes just like on real paper. If you want to do more than make some text yellow, the highlighter tool has useful features such as adjustable thickness and transparency. You can also highlight in any color you can write in. The Select tool lets you move your notes around in ways that you can't on physical paper. Say you don't think your title pops enough, select your title by drawing around it with the Select tool. You can change the stroke's thickness, change its color, resize the selection by dragging on one of the orange handles around it, move it around, and even copy and paste it. There are two types of erasers in Squid. The default is the stroke eraser, and it will erase the whole stroke of anything it touches. The true eraser, on the other hand, will only erase the parts of strokes that it touches, like a physical eraser. Shape tools are useful for when you want to draw something more precisely than you can by hand. Say you want to draw a graph of a circle. You could draw a boundary for the graph using a square. Then use the line tool to draw X and Y axes. We'll make them thicker to stand out. Next, we'll draw the circle itself and make it red to be different from the grid. The text tool is great for adding one-line labels that are more neat than handwriting. Tap anywhere and you'll be given a text box to fill in. Once you hit OK, you can drag your label around to put it where you want. You can change the size of the text using a slider and change its color just like with other tools. Once you've created text, use the select tool to make changes. You can change the color. Adjust the size, and edit the text itself. Thanks for watching! For more help on how to use Squid, check out our FAQ page and other videos at squidnotes.com.